In 1990, a man named Talib Hoshikov saw a little bear cub who was only a month and a half old in the house of his friends who were living in a mountain village. According to them, the mama bear was shot by hunters and the bear cub with an injured paw was picked up by people from the village. Talib immediately felt compassion for this animal, so he gave its owners a bag of flour and a goat for the bear. The bear cub turned out to be a female. In those years, the Mexican TV show Just Maria was very popular and he decided to name his pet in honor of the main heroine. I fed her like a child. I was even giving her milk so that she would become smart. And indeed, Maria did become very smart, sweet, and very friendly to people. Many people pass by without ever saying hello, which is not very polite, so I say to my Maria, let's show them. Maria gets up, starts bowing and greeting, then I say to the passersby, look and learn from my bear. Also, if you have not done so already, please subscribe to our channel and click that notification bell to get inspired by these animal stories every day. Now back to the story. The old man and the bear weren't only giving performances in Tajikistan, but also traveling to Kazakhstan, Kyrgyzstan, and Uzbekistan. Maria wasn't just a ward for the old man, he admitted that he loved her as his own daughter and also called her his daughter. By the way, the old man had 13 children. Talib Hoshi was over 80 when he died in 2012. After that, there were rumors in the city that the bear couldn't stand the separation from her master. But we managed to find out from the director of the Don Chamba Zoo that the bear is alive and she is the most famous among all the bears in the zoo. Children loved her, treated her with sweets, and took pictures of her from afar. According to the zoo employees, the first days after she came there, the bear didn't sleep at night and refused to eat. But step by step, she got used to her new place of living and later made friends with the employees of the zoo and they were all looking out for her. The man's youngest son is just 18, and he grew up with the bear and came to the zoo every Sunday to see the bear. For the first year, he says the bear was angry with them and didn't want to talk. Maria's eyesight has become worse. However, she can still smell the owners. When they approached her, she would realize from afar that they were coming and she would start to stretch out her paws. Sometimes she also cries. The first year she was brought to the zoo, she was very defensive. Her family would come to the zoo and start calling her, but she didn't even look at them. She would shake her head, saying no that way. But with time, she felt more comfortable in her new place. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and consider sharing it with your friends and family. Thanks again, and we'll see you in the next one.